Well, to all my 3D printing scholars, I hope that you enjoy this fun little project that I came up with. You know, it's funny, you would think that for something so small and so simple, it would be easy to figure out how to do it, and yet it took me seven iterations before I finally got there. I started out wanting to do something with a embedded hinge that I tried to clip, but it never really had enough strength to hold onto it, even though I tried to do that several times. And then finally I just gave up on it and decided to make the hinge a solid piece that was flexy. But when I first tried this one out, it was taking the tie and pushing it back too far, despite even trying to adjust the angle. It wasn't until the end that I finally realized I needed to break the clip out to be a separate part. And even this final iteration here isn't the iteration that you can download right now because it's too big. It sticks up out of the sides. And while these are the sides that are gonna be hidden inside the collar of the shirt. I just uh, just took it down just a little bit. So even to the end, it's still taking iterations and, and attempts to remake it to make it happen. But I hope that you've enjoyed this project. I hope you try to make your own duct tape tie. Uh, this isn't a shirt to be wearing a tie with, especially not a tie as silly as this one. But I just wanted to show off that, yeah, it really does work and it's, it's very good. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time. Thank you.